to simplify the system, let's do substitution. Let a equals log x, b equals log y, c equals log z. So the system becomes a b minus a minus v b equals negative one. The second b times a minus four b minus a equals zero. The last one c a minus v c minus four a equals negative four. Now. The first equation, we can write the first equation as a b minus one minus three b. To create a factor of b minus one for the remaining term, we plus three to both sides. So plus three, the right side equals two. Similarly, for the second, so we get b c minus four minus c plus four, the rise are also plus four, so we get four. For the last one, I can take C, so A minus three minus four A, I plus 12 to both sides, so I get eight. Now we can factor the left side. So the first one can be written as A minus three, B minus one equals two. The second, B minus one, C minus four equals four. The last one, C minus four, and then A minus three equals eight. We can do further substitution. So let P equals A minus V. Q equals B minus one. R equals C minus four. So we get a new system. The first one is PQ equals two. The second QR equals four. The last one rp equals a to solve pqr we multiply the left side and the right side so we get pqr square the right side equals 64 so you see take square root so we get pq yeah, PQR equals plus or minus eight. So using these equations, we can solve PQR. So I'll say P equals PQR over QR. So we get plus minus eight over uh, QR four. So we get plus or minus two. Similarly, you can see uh, Q equals PQR over uh, PR or RP. So it be plus minus A over eight. So equals plus minus one. Finally, R equals PQR over PQ. So plus minus A over um, Q, so we get plus minus four. So the possible values of PQR are PQR are two, one, four, or negative two, negative one, negative four. So then now we can get back to X. So X, Y, Z, look at that because a equals log x. So x equals 10 to the power of a. Similarly, 10 to the power of b, 10 to the power of c. Now from here, right? So we know 
a equals p plus v, so 10 p plus v, yeah. and 10 to b, so b equals q plus 1, for c equals r plus 4, r plus 4. So when we plug in 214 for p, so we get 10 to the power 5, 10 to the power of 2, 10 to the power of 8, or when we plug in PQR as negative 2, negative 1, negative 4, so we get 10 to 1, which is 10, 10 to 0, which is 1, 10 to 0, which is 1, again. So we have two possible solutions for XYZ.